yeah, I, I actually don't know. I don't know how else it's gonna go. I, I think I have Tilly favored, but I definitely feel like this could be this could be anyone's game. Good combo. Oh, yes. I don't. Did he jab on purpose? I don't think so. He's probably up tilt. Ivysaur, yep. Good up B kill. Good, yeah. I feel like Falco should do well versus Squirtle, but you have to be you have to play it very grounded. But I mean it doesn't matter, he switched to Ivysaur. Oh he missed the edge guard, he's gonna die. Yeah. Yeah. That was that was a huge overextension. I like commend him for going for for the edge guard, but he just he reached way too hard for that. That's stock. Yeah. There's there's no way he was missing that. Yeah, I mean, he did make the comeback versus Yoda Cage, but I feel like it's going to be a lot harder. Oh, oh, he might be dead. I think if he actually went... Oh, I think if he actually went for the upper, he could have potentially killed uh, Quid if he got the up air wrong as a uh, Squirtle. Uh, Quid could have taken the game there. Oh, he got it though. Um, when Tilde up tilted his shield, he could have up smashed him. Alright, so game two on uh, small battlefield. Yeah, right now, I feel like I feel like Tilly's playing too aggressive. He kind of needs to slow down a bit. Or, well, he got the hit. Never mind. <laughs> yeah, I feel like he's playing neutral, like, a, a little bit too too aggressive. Ooh, that's it. Yeah. Good Razor Leaf from Quid. Nice. Good weight on the switch. Okay, got the down smash. <laughs> Dude, Tilly just won wanted to dare. He just wanted to dare him like five times. That whip punish on the floor there is actually really good. I, was, I actually didn't think that was going to work. Nice. And do it again, yeah. So the Nair drag down uh, normally isn't true, but I mean it worked there because we just wasn't expecting it. But you normally can't get anything guaranteed off of dragging down Nair like at that height. Back throw, up throw, second kill. Good for Till. He caught Till they try to drop double jump fair, I'm assuming. Run off there. So this goes for the trump. Misses the downer conversion. Oh, he broke his shield. I don't think he can kill him, though. Yeah. I want to say Quid should have switched to Ivysaur and just comboed him. He probably could have gotten like 60% as Ivysaur. Here. Misses, yeah. Tilde is so good at angling his uh, up B and then just holding down, making it really hard to two-frame him. Okay, that should be a stock, you yep. That was such a good idea from Tilde. It would have been better if he uh, walked instead of ran, though. Okay, good call. That's gonna do it, yeah. I feel like Tilde's not playing as confidently as he did the previous game. It's that, and I also feel like Tilde's just playing too aggressive in, in terms of neutral. He's running in too much. I also think when with Squirtle, he just needs to be less jump happy. It's actually really hard for Squirtle to deal with Falco if he's just grounded and abuses his tilts. Well, like, forward tilt and down tilt. I mean, you could also anti with up tilt. Like, forward tilt and down tilt in particular are just hard for Ivysaur to, or Squirtle to deal with unless he jumps 
And Falco's also really good at dealing with jump ins. There. Oh no. Yeah, but I, I I feel like you want to you want to get the first drag down because maybe he was hoping quickly panic, but he didn't. He got the stock there. Okay, yeah, Tilde's playing this this a lot better. A lot more patient, less antsy. Yeah, he's dead there though. <laughs> Good combo. Be it. Oh, that's a good jump read. Stock. Oh, barely looking. So that, oh, a B. Oh, there's the up smash. Alright, Quid takes the lead. And he's gonna say he's gonna say Charizard because he just wants the survivability. He also just kind of he could he could potentially steal a stock. Kind of doing it. Oh no, that that might be it. Or took it too early. Up smash? Yeah, I knew it. All right, Quinton top eight. Damn, I was not expecting a three. I, I thought this that would be a lot closer, but I, I don't know. If it just felt like Tilde, the way Tilde was playing was very impatient against Squirtle. It just felt like he wasn't comfortable in fighting in that matchup. And then there's also a lot of situations where he could have edge guarded. But it's like Tilde is uncomfortable for going for particular edge guarding options, even though they're not as committal as, as as they might seem. Quid has been on a tear. Don't count this kid out. He's coming forward to buzz his throne. He wants to become the king of New York, and everyone is, is behind him. All the New Yorkers are behind him. They have those those slapping things. I don't know what you call them. And every time Quid hits mute, they're gonna be yelling and going crazy. I have to feel like the world's against you. Yeah, dude, uh, Yanni felt felt that. If you're not used to crowds being against you, not fun. Something that Quinn is doing different from Beast, uh, Beast is the is like the uh, trainer that Mutes fought winners round one, which it went to game five. When he fought Beast, Beast started Ivysaur and it was working pretty well. He actually very very li rarely used Squirtle against Mute. Um, so far, going they're going pretty even. Oh, that's. I don't think that's the sweet spot of the bottom. Man. Oof, this might be it. Dare? Oh, it doesn't go for the dare. Good four there to get out of the corner. That should be a stock. Yeah. Mute actually had the read on the regular get up. He just mistimed it. I think he did it a bit too early. That's oh good evasion. I think Quid jumped back in order to avoid the turn up there. Good up smash out of shield. Fun fact: Charizard's up smash is the is the second fastest up smash in the game. Believe it's frame six. So I, I, I'm liking the set so far. It's very, very even. Ooh, this, okay, he had his float. I didn't think he had his float. Oh, he has double jump too, but did not matter. That is why Ivysaur is very good versus Peach. Not only can Ivysaur fight Peach pretty well in neutral, but it's very easy for Ivysaur to uh, edge guard Peach with Dare because of how big the down air hitbox is. Um, normally a lot of characters have trouble like attempting the two frame Peach because her parasol hitbox is actually pretty huge. Okay, it is a fair. But yeah, if you've never looked at Peach's Parasol hitbox, I, I have, you should check it out. It's very big. A lot of characters just cannot challenge that move, or it's, like it's, it's very impossible to two-frame for a lot of characters. Oh, okay. For some reason, when Mute hit him with the trample, I thought he was gonna kill him. Nice, nice roll read. Looking for a fair. Mute, Mute Ace is definitely looking for a fair. Still looking for it. Ooh, he's in a bad spot. Good evasion. 
Nice. This is a pretty bad spot for Quid. He almost had it. That's not it, yeah. Too high of a percent to, to get that combo, I think. This is so close. The weak hit of back air. That's it. Yeah. Wow. <laughs> if all the matches are like this, this is going to be a very good winner's finals. That was a nail biter. That was only game one. Yeah, Quid maintaining his win streak so far. He still has not dropped a single game. Okay, this is looking more more heavily favored than Quid. Or for Quid. Mute's not ha is having a lot of issues getting out of this, okay? Still barely... Okay, I was going to say he barely has any damage on him. But there it is, racking it up. Nice. I'm going to get the edge guard here. No, not yet. That was nice. This is so back and forth. Back to reacting him off stage. Oh, it's a regrab. Yep, it's your life. They're running away with this. Okay, back throw is not going to kill yet, though. Good roll read with the fair. Wow. Takes mute stock without taking barely any damage. A B, yep. Good roll from uh, Mute. Wade's doing such a such a good job of just making it difficult for Mute to edge guard him. Yeah, like especially Ivysaur. Like it's been really hard for Mute to do anything against Ivysaur off stage. That's it, yep. Yeah. Alright. 2-0 quid. The New Yorkers are popping off. Now let's see what Mute can do. Mute's still in this. Oh my god. This is, this is looking like another 3-0 for Quid. Quinn's currently looking like the Prince of New York, soon to be king. He's the next rightful heir to the throne. Oh wait, maybe I spoke too soon. Oh, is he dead? Yo, he is! Yeah, Peach's air dodge is horrible. Peach has one of the laggiest air dodges in the game. It's really bad. I mean, he's still in. It's still... still do something. He has Peach combos. What? Alright. Oh. He bringing it back. Yeah, Mew has to be careful though. One Rage Leap will, will definitely make him lose his stock. That'll be game. Or an edge guard. But for sure the Razor Leaf. If he gets hit with a Razor Leaf on stage, that's it. Barely missed that. Okay. Still in a good, good spot. That might be not yet. He was still Ivy, so I think that would have killed. Oh, that's it! Quid bleeds! It took me some time, but he, he is adapted. And that was a rough game to bring back. You gotta remember, yes, Deed. Yes, Deed, like, 0%. And he brought that all the way back. But yeah, this could definitely be a reverse 3-0. Alright. 
Oh my god. So is Quid. Quid is also ready. Oh, this could be a stock. Barely missed. Still off stage though. Jeez, all right. Quid is one sock away from being in Grands. Wait a minute. I need to find out right now. We're looking for all right. Here we go, man. So trying to get right back in it. And this is, I mean, look, mute on this stock particularly. Yeah, only 40 I feel like mute just turns this turns on. He just turns on this form where he just does not want to get hit anymore. Good turn up, side B, yeah, he has to. He stock, he messed up. Oh my god, that was it. That was that was for sure quick stock, but he gets it there without getting much damage. Good, good recovery. Yeah, he didn't get hit with the sweet spot. Yeah, Quid, Quid is trying to end this. He's trying to get these dare edge guards. Yeah, not yet. Good the eye on the razor leaf from you. It's like Quid's kind of getting a little bit antsy. Board smash. Oh, is that it? Up throw? Oh, down throw. Yeah, he does. He does it. Quid's in grants. Going to all the New York homies. Dude, that was that was a good set. That was a good set. Good stuff to quit. So now Cola is going into his 13th loser set. Again, he lost round one of top 128. Let's see what let's see what Quinn can do to adjust. I mean, so far he's doing well, but he has to close out the slot. That's the thing that's important. Doesn't matter how much percent you give Cola if you don't take if you don't take him out. He will. He's shown he can kill you off of off of an inch. Nice up smash. Okay, I thought, I feel like, but uh, oh, okay, he got the kill there. I was gonna say, I feel like Quick could have killed Cole off the first mistake with a jab, jab on uh, forward smash. Ooh, good damage. Oh, the down smash. That should be it. That should still be it. Yeah. That was, that was a free edge guard. There's no way he was missing that. Oh, he got beat so early. I feel like Cole could have seen that coming. Especially in that position, there was nothing else Quinn could have done to, to, to do anything. Ooh, this could be... This could be Cola running out of steam. Maybe Quid adjusted to, to Cola's playstyle. Maybe it's a little both. way too early that was a panic from from cola i'm surprised at how early he upbeat in that situation all right now quid is one match away one game away from taking this tournament becoming proud the new king of new york okay, so far it's pretty even wait a minute i thought quid was going to take it take a sock i thought he was going to offer him there it is Wow, that worked. Oh, what if what if Quid had a water gun there instead of just hitting him? 
Oh, that was it. That was the stock. That was jab lock to uh, forward smash. Oh, there it is again. He's just not. Uh, Quits are reacting. That's a stock. Yeah, good side B from uh, Cola. Good reversal bear. Now for a B. Oh no, it goes for up air. Good evasion. Oh, oh, is that it? Barely lives. From off stage. Go for another edge guard. Doesn't get it. That's it. Yep, that's it. Quid does it. Quid wins his first major. This is definitely something that no one expected. No one was expecting, what was he, the 32nd seed? Yeah, he wins. Probably one of the biggest tournament win upsets, like in, in, in the ultimate. I don't think there's been a tournament where someone seeded that low had, had, had won.